Hi everyone, welcome back finally to a Wise Source opening. So we took a break from Wise Source to do some Goddess story and some other AliExpress cards uh, because I was waiting for some of the sets to be released. So one of the sets for English at least was uh, Attack of Titan, a uh, final season. Uh, Japan of course we are looking for the Pixar set but that was apparently delayed. Uh, quintessential Queen Triplets, uh, Princess Connect, those are also uh, been a bit delayed in shipping because I tried to consolidate it with the Pixar set uh, but I expect those uh, will be shipped out soon since I have separate the orders to at least get me the Princess Connect as well as the Quintessential Queen Triplet. so hopefully we can do the opening soon for the Japan side but at least for the English side today very excited to have this uh, Attack of Titan final season so I have gotten a supply set over here uh, the booster box as well as the trial deck so a lot of interesting things to open. Uh, similarly, for a box, a booster box, there was uh, I was given a special PR pack as well. So a lot of interesting things to go through today. Uh, but you know what? Let's start with the supply set because uh, we don't usually get this in uh, for the Japan releases. So I'm always very happy uh, to open uh, those supply sets for English, especially if it's a series that has them. Okay, so let's see what do we have here. What's up? Usually a supply set comes with a deck box. Oh, look at all the characters. Very nice. Very nice. The top. Mm hmm Yep. Yeah, I like the deck box. Uh, plastic material. And we have a sleeve as well. Ooh. I mean, cool design for sure. Mm, not sure I'm entirely... Uh, like, not my favorite design per se, but I still think it's quite cool. Okay, breakdown. So this set does have uh, 1 SEC, 5 SSP, 9 Titan Rare, 7 Triple Rare, and 19 SR. So the breakdown is the same as the booster box because uh, we are given 5 booster packs and 1 special PR pack as well in the supply set. So that's interesting. Just going to open this. Whoa. <laughs> The PR pack is very tight. Okay, I try to open from the side and not damage any cuts. Let's take them out. Okay, so let's see our PR cuts. Cool. And one foil PR. I'm just going to sleeve the foil on first. Not sure if they are worth anything, but... Uh, it's a shame that it is not textured or anything. Uh, you know, like... Uh, the quintessential quintuplet PR pack where the foil version have some uh, ghost stamping on it. That was actually really, really cool. Okay, we got an SR uh, from our individual packs. I mean, I wasn't expecting even any hit from those. I don't know about you guys, but it seems like the English version production quality isn't as great compared to the Japan release. But it's okay, let's see what the cards. We have our rare, we have our climax. Okay. Pack number two, let's go. Rare and climax. Okay, maybe let me see if I can zoom in a little bit to show off the card more. Just a little bit. Okay, let's see. Okay, double rare, Levi. I like the artwork actually of Levi. Hmm. So, so far from our 5 packs, 1 S, uh, 1 double rare. I think not too bad, considering that these are loose packs without any fixed ratio. Okay, last pack. Okay, rare and climax. Cool. Okay, so that was our loose pack. So we do have one double rare from it and one SR. That's quite cool. Okay, I want to do the trial deck next. I'm curious to see uh, the type of cuts uh, that is included in the trial deck. Actually, I didn't order this and my supplier said, hey, you only ordered the booster pack and the supply set. Are you sure you don't want the trial deck? I was like, wait a minute, there's a trial deck for final season? I wasn't aware of that. So I say, well, I mean, I do have some left over if you want. I could like, help you reserve a couple and I say, yeah, hit me up for two. So first of all, our SR. SR, and let's look at the cuts in the draw deck. 
Okay, just going to go slightly faster and see. I believe that there should be some trial deck signs, but those will be extremely, extremely hard to pull. Okay, climax. War oh, heroine. Oops. Yeah, so let me know what you guys think of the artwork for this final season. Wow, Raining Titan, so what a climax card. <laughs> okay, so... Oh, you got a triple rare! Oh man... Uh, I say all oh, man is... Yes, I mean it is a lucky hit, but there is... Because of this triple rare... There shouldn't be anything in our uh, second trial deck then. So yeah, triple rare. But yeah, Gabby over here, very nice, triple rare. Somehow the high rarity cards for this set doesn't seem as crazy textured compared to some of the uh, other recent release that we see. So, I don't know. But I guess it's also to keep it consistent with uh, Attack of Titan Season 1 and Season 2 stuff. Because those were actually quite old sets, and even when the reprint, they didn't do anything new to the treatment of the cards. They just do a perfect reprint. Signature-wise, everything still remains the same. So I guess to make it consistent, especially all the cards can be played together, right? Is to make sure that, yep, nothing. Is to make sure that at the very least, uh, the foils and everything are consistent. So it seems like that's their intention here, and that's why we don't see anything too crazy for the high rarity cards. Because the last Japan set we opened, man, those textures were insane. Oh, okay, maybe before we go that, uh, let me do the PR packs first. Okay, so two PR packs before we go into our booster boxes. Let's see. Okay, so it seems like three non-foil cards and one foil. Let's see what other cards we have. Okay. Aaron Titan. Yeah, I mean, no texture or anything, so a bit disappointing. So like I mentioned, it could be a deliberate choice to keep it consistent with set 1 and 2. It has to be, right, because a lot of the even more recent set has very nice texture, so it's not like they don't have the uh, technology to do so, they definitely do. It's just that the decision probably is to keep it consistent with season 1 and season 2 otherwise your deck will look very weird with oh some crazy new shiny stuff and your old cards look very out of place over there okay we still have our box topper pro box toppers promo okay uh for some reason two box topper promo i'm thinking we only get one but we got two somehow so i'm going to complain over there Okay, let's go a bit faster. Double rare, Rainer. Nice. I, I like the double rare background. Those artworks are very nice. So I'm guessing that uh, for the SR, some of these double rares will be converted to a SR foiling. We'll be curious to see how they look. So I still do not know what's the box ratio, but I believe the carton ratio for a type of Titans is uh, 1 SSP. Uh, Three Titan Rares, I believe. I think one SEC, one SSP, and three Titan Rares. So, uh, considering that I think for English is sixteen box per carton, so your hit is should be about one is to three boxes, three to four boxes. So if we can get a hit today, that would already mean that we are extremely lucky because I only have two boxes to go through today. Okay, Mikasa, I like the double Rares. The double Rares are really very nice. I mean, foiling pattern is very simple, so like I said, it seems consistent with the old set. Just a very simple dot pattern, as you can see from this card. It's just a very simple dot pattern for the rest. Double rare, okay, Aaron Titan, cool. Our rare, and our climax.
this is also whoa this is a titan rare no wonder it looks so crazy okay sorry guys i was admiring the card for myself wow facing off very very nice titan rare and this is definitely definitely a texture on it you can see very nice card okay where was i put this aside hang on i have my double sleeve i do So we already pulled a high, uh, one of the high rarity cards you can get from the case, apart from the SI and all that. So um, I think we already hit our luck uh, limit for the day. But let's see. Oh, oh wow, the SI is also really nice. So we have Hing, Growing Suspicion. Okay, so it seems like the promo card doesn't have the texture, but the SR at least do have it. I was a bit disappointed, uh, especially the SR in the trial decks were not textured, but the booster seems to do a good job. Okay, so two high rarity cards so far. We have our Titan Rare and we have our SR. So is it going to be two uh, high rarity cards per box? That would be nice, but let's quickly... Let's quickly go through because I'm mindful of the time that we are spending. Okay, double rare, Falco, our rare, and climax. Soon we will also find out how many double rares we have per box. Uh, possibly five, I, I hope. What were the ratios on the double rest? The double rest? Uh, 10. 10 types of double rest. So it would be nice if they could actually give us 5 double rest per box. Because a lot of the old sets used to be 8 double rest. So, uh, including 4 double rest on the box isn't too unreasonable. But the recent sets have always seen a more number of double rest. We have 10 double rest, 12 double rest. So it makes it very hard. Uh, especially if you only have a few boxes to get a play set of that. So let's see, how many double rares do we have? Oh, that's a nice card, even though it's a, a uncommon only. Our rare and climax. Okay, so let's see double rares. We have one, two, three. Okay, so it seems like four, four double rares. Don't count the one we got from our supply set. Four double rares per box, unless the Titan rare replaced one of those double rares slot. Could be. I'm not certain, but let's find out. This second box will give us a bit more insight on what are the ratios per box. Okay, okay. So similarly interesting. Two two box topper per box. So total we have four box topper here. Get our packs out. Okay, and that's it. Let's continue with our opening. Maybe let me set our bulk aside so we have a bit more room to work with. Okay. Curious to see what S, how the SR card will look like for this box. At least for the booster, the texture looks decent enough. Very consistent with some of the newer sets that we have. If you go back and look at your old, okay, SR. Yeah, so like I said, texture is consistent with some of the newer sets that we got. Even the, uh, what do you call that? You know the that thing that display your length of service that is in four, so that's cool. Ziki, okay. So SR, will we get another high rarity cards from this box? Here to find out. Let's go. Rare. 
Oh my goodness. <sighs> Two Titan Rares. Wow, 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 wow. Decoration of War. Okay, let me sleep this first. Look at that. Okay, I'm not sure if you guys can see it well, but this is very, very gorgeous. I mean, a bit dark, but <laughs> gorgeous, very gorgeous artwork. Okay, let's keep going. Wow. So, probably two high rarity cards are consistent per box, and we get four double rare per box. So, it seems like that's the ratio, at the very least. So unfortunately no sign card, but I mean if we did have a sign card, it's the SSP, so those are, uh, those used to be like one per case, right? It is still one per case for this set, so uh, the standard sign cards are actually replaced this time by Titan Rares, so we got two of those. But I'm not sure, I mean, you can say that, well it's not a sign card, it is like as though we had two sign cards. Double rare, Sasha. Was that our first double rare of Sasha? Nice. So the rest of these packs will definitely not contain anything. I'm just going through it just for the sake of finishing and rounding up the box. Ooh, look at that climax. Decoration of war. Okay, so we do have the normal version of uh, our two Titan Rare. Seems like the normal version are Climaxes Rare. Rare Climaxes, what am I saying? Okay, Double Rare Levi. Uh, two more. Okay, Double Rare. Last pack. Let's go. Okay, all our double rest happen to be in the last few packs of the box. Okay, so total including our supply set, we should have 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So yep, 4 double rest per box. 2 SR cards today, very gorgeous. So I was worried that there wouldn't be texture, but there is texture. And then we were fortunate enough to have 2 Titan rares. I mean, look at these guys. The artwork, the foiling is phenomenal. Very nice, very nice. I just very quickly go and show off one, okay, and the second one. So yeah, I think we really luck out in today's opening. Unfortunately, we didn't pull anything spectacular, but we still have a triple rare, right, from our, where is it, from our trial deck. So I think that this, all in all, is a fantastic opening for the day and a very good way to round up the final season of Attack of Titans, at least for me. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this opening. Take care. Uh, stay safe and we will see you guys soon uh, as we get into some of the newer Japan releases. Princess Connect is coming, uh, Quintessential Quintuplets. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, do subscribe so you will be notified as soon as I get to those. Take care, stay safe and bye now!